In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to spawn any weapon on the ground for the player to pick up. This is perfect for FY or fight yard maps and aim maps. To do this, it's actually very simple. Head over to Entity Tool and left click to enable. Then come over here under Objects, use the drop down menu and scroll all the way on the bottom until you get to Weapons. And here are all the weapon entities you can use and place them on the ground. So let's start with AK-47. Select it and left click inside the perspective viewport. This will place the weapon entity right on the ground. Now if you leave your weapon as is and when you spawn inside the map, the physics of the object will place the weapon on the ground. So you will actually see this weapon move right on spawn. So it's better not to leave weapons like this, but actually align and rotate them to the ground. So I'm going to leave this as is, and I'm going to place another one right next to it. Let's go to Move Tool, and let's switch over to Side View. Let's go ahead and press Ctrl E to center our selection on the selected entity. And let's go ahead and zoom in way in. And I'm going to rotate this so it's aligned on the ground. And we may need to use the bracket keys. So we go to Snap Grid set to 1 so we can align this properly. And here back in the perspective viewport we have the weapon placed on the ground. Now let's go ahead and compile and test it inside the map. Let's walk over the weapon and pick it up. I'm also going to quickly restart the map so you can see the weapon that we did not align to the ground that it will move and drop to the ground plane. So let's go ahead and select this AK-47, the one that's not aligned to the ground, and delete it. And with this entity tool, you can insert any of these weapons onto the ground plane for the player to pick up. So you can structure this as a training aim map where you include nothing else but AK-47s, AWPs, or you can do this as a FY map, as a fight yard map and include multiple sets of weapons and different types. And you would do this for each team spawn, for CT side and for T side. And the easiest way to duplicate weapons is after you've placed one and aligned it to the ground, go to top view, hold down shift, left click hold and drag to duplicate it. And now in perspective viewport, double click on the weapon entity and then use the drop down menu to change to any weapon type, click apply. This will update and it will be already aligned to the ground so you don't have to realign it. And this will be the fastest way to update your weapons to a different type of weapon. Also, do not include any buy zones if you do not want players to purchase any weapons at the start of the round. And finally, save your map and compile to test it. Let's go, let's go. 